Hello everyone. This is just a short video uh, slash walkthrough to show you how you can access the Collaborate Ultra uh, tool that is going to be used for our uh, online uh, office hours, for uh, normal classroom presentations while we move to the uh, online format. Uh, I will show you how to uh, get there and how to uh, use the tool. So first you will just go and select the course that you are um, engaged in. So for me I'm just going to come down here to my NOS 120 class as an example, but you will obviously click uh, your specific class. Over here on the left you will see the um, uh, various uh, options for your class and um, uh, so you will just scroll down here to uh, Blackboard Tools and in here if you scroll down there will be a option for Blackboard Collaborate Ultra okay so you will uh, click on Blackboard Collaborate Ultra which will bring you to the uh, main page for this tool you'll notice up here that there is always a sort of open room for you to come and uh, be in. Uh, so if you want to have sessions with your classmates or you want to have a video chat uh, with somebody else in uh, this classroom or this course, you can just click on this uh, link at any time and that will open up the video chat. Um, the uh, other possibility is that you will possibly see a session that is going to be scheduled. So perhaps a Monday morning uh, session, there will be a link down here. Uh, but this is a room that is always open and so you should, should be able to just click on that and enter the room. Okay, you can join it in a number of different ways. You can just click on it and you will be taken there with your uh, web browser. Uh, and you can, if you, where you can use your audio, your video, you can upload documents, as I'll show you shortly. If you find that you're not getting good audio uh, or you can't speak, uh, you can dial in anonymously uh, using uh, this dial in number. So this is going to be specific to you, not uh, so the whatever the pin is here that you will get a uh, specific pin that is unique to you so that is I, the, so that we can identify who you are. So I'm just going to come up here and join the course room. Uh, you will see the uh, screen um, open up and you will be joining. So we'll just pause on that. All right, so down here along the bottom, there are your uh, video and audio. Right now, these are turned off because they have a little line through them. By turning that on, uh, you would be able to speak and I would be able to hear you. If you turned on your video, uh, uh, your uh, video, your webcam would turn on and I would be able to see your face. Um, we have another raise your hand. So if we're in class and you have a question, uh, you can certainly raise your hand there and I would be able to see it on my side. The other two things you want to pay attention to is this tab up here on the left. If you click on that, there will be a number of uh, Collaborate Ultra basic tools where you can use your phone for audio, as I mentioned, or at the end of the session, you can click down here in the bottom left as a leave session. So that's how you would leave the room. Um, so that's just a general overall usage. And then over here on the bottom right, there are uh, going to be other tools like a chat room or a chat panel where you can uh, say something. So you just type there in the bo bottom box and that gets posted up there where everybody can see. You can add your little gifts, right? And, and then you can and do that. Um, I can see who is all who all is here. And I have some control over who can do what. So as a presenter, if you were in here, I could pass the control of the session over to you. So if you wanted to share something from your screen, you could be able to do it. If, I, if you wanted to upload a file, you would be able to do that as well. Um, on my end, 
um, you can we can uh, do a couple of different things. We can share a blank whiteboard. So if you look at these options down here, right, you can share a blank whiteboard. So we come up here and you can just grab a hold of that and type some text. All right, uh, you can then erase it. Uh, you can draw some nice little shapes, you know, so if you want to uh, fill that in, um, maybe draw another little ellipse, something like that. Uh, if you wanted to uh, drag things around, you can do that. Or if you wanted to point so that other people can see what you're talking about, that's a, that little pointer there. Okay. Uh, so that's that whiteboard. Um, I could also be uploading some files. So you'll notice this uh, tool can uh, de deal with PowerPoint or PDF files, not Word documents or image files, but PowerPoint and PDFs. So you can just uh, click up in here and add a particular file that you might be interested in. And then, um, and that will be added up. And then I could, sh you can share that file with the group or I can fair that share that file with the group. Okay. Uh, the other possibility is that we could be doing some labs uh, online together. So I might uh, have a browser window open and um, or a Word document open and I might share with you whatever that uh, that document is. So um, and as you can see this is what you would uh, be shown up here. So any edits that I made um, some more edits. I could make a change to the document live and that would show up on your side as well. So as you can see there are lots of tools that we can use to uh, learn remotely, sharing files, uh, sharing a whiteboard, uh, and uh, sharing uh, browser windows and things like that. So we can do a lot of the things that we're doing live in person uh, virtually using this tool. What I will try to do is during these sessions I will try to remember to record these sessions so if you are not able to make it uh, to the class itself due to a number of different reasons uh, that class session will be available to you uh, later as a downloadable uh, video. So. Uh, with that, that's all there is to it, to this tool to use. So let me uh, leave this session and walk you back and show you how to access the actual recordings. So assuming this room, uh, this class session was recorded, you would come up here to your three horizontal lines menu and then just come down here to the record settings. If there are recordings, then there will be some here in this uh, in this window, which you should be able to uh, click on and then download or watch inside the window pane itself. Okay, uh, so that's basically it. Blackboard Collaborate Ultra is a very simple to use tool that I think will uh, serve us well. If you have any other questions, please uh, do not hesitate to email me and. Uh, your instructor will uh, be able to give you a hand uh, sorting this out. Thank you very much. Have a good day.